seem like you can be subtle about, you know, when you're against government policies, you can't really be subtle about it. Otherwise, the message just doesn't get through. A lot of people miss the message uh, uh, and miss the meaning if, if people put a lot of words to it. It's simply, you know, you've got to start off by saying, you know, Bush sucks. And then you then you can list some reasons because you got their attention. Well, well, they said it, and then you can drop it in. You're dealing with young kids that are just becoming aware that they're being screwed, and uh, they're basically realizing that all that uh, both our countries advertise about freedom and uh, being yourself and uh, being an individualist. When they finally get to high school, they realize if they're an individualist, they're criticized, and. Uh, that really is, uh, it's, it's a beginning, an awakening, and bands like me, Warrior Soul, Pete, uh, and uh, other people, ex-CIA people that are going around doing lectures and stuff, we're kind of uh, the new mouthpieces, of the Abby Hoffmans, the reactionaries to this. And sometimes we go a little far, but sometimes you gotta push a little farther to get it to move at all, so that's where we're at. don't have a, a central issue necessarily like you did in the 60s. It was easier for bands to walk out and go, hey, we're against the war. The war stinks. People are dying. La, 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 la. And that's easy. And it's easy to bring people around that. And when people go, yeah, forget it. You know, that's not cool. Now, there's so many different issues. And it's like, you can't just go out and rock and roll and go, save the whales. It just ain't going to cut it, you know? You've got to... But it's... It's an important issue at the same time, so you've got to kind of make people aware, draw people in, make them aware of it in a way that's got a style and a grace, and that's what we try to achieve. <laughs>